turn around, you have two methods to turn around in the circle. One is by use of using an outside hooking step, and the other one is by use of using the inside hooking step. First we'll go over the inside hooking step. An inside hooking step, I'm going to start on the circle. What we do is we'll practice, we're going to walk, and we're going to stop with the inside foot forward. From there, we take the outside foot, we hook our feet together so that our feet make a T. The instep of the outside foot comes to the toe of the inside foot. So in this case, my left foot hook steps and makes a T with my right foot. I keep my body weight down, my back straight so I have good posture, and the weight is even on both feet. Once we practice, this will open up all the hips and stretch the hip area out. Then we just turn, pick the foot up, momentarily inside empty, and then we just walk again until we're ready to turn around. So we make our inside hook step, T. The legs are close together, so the knees come together, the thighs squeeze slightly together. The feet are not far apart. We turn around. Practice this. Practice walking one full circle. Hook step. Turn around and step. This should end up being a very quick step. One, two, three. Hook. Step. Turn. And when you hook step, always step with the ball of the foot first. The toe hits, the heel follows. Step. Do this until you can do this with no thought and no effort.